he brays all the time. What do we say about chewing before we speak? Third day, he was at the house. I was in the back, putting food in the buckets. And all of a sudden, he just started braying. And it scared all of us. He looked just as shocked as the rest of us. He's 26, quite old, when they rescued him. Monty is off in the corner, really quiet, shy. He never made any noise while we were there. But he was so sweet. And I was like, oh my gosh, this is the one. So Monty got off the trailer and it was like he'd been there his whole life. I have horses. All three of them got along instantly. Especially Ace. They bonded so well. Those two will chase each other all around the property. Monty is too short to grab Ace's neck like donkeys do. So he will run up behind Ace and bite his butt. It is hilarious. Every time Monty became super friendly, that is hugely attributed to having Ace. He's feeling more and more confident every day. He discovered his voice. And he'll just yell at the door until I come outside and give him treats. He'll bray at me to talk back to say hi. We call him the dinner bell. have all kinds of different ideas of what he could be singing. Frank Sinatra songs. I'll state my case, of which I'm certain. Lady Gaga. He's just happy to be able to have found his voice and tell everybody about it. <laughs> Giving an animal like him a second chance at life, that's incredible.